While all of America's national parks provide wildlife, views, and unforgettable experiences throughout the year, some parks shine brightest in the summer. Even in the midst of the summer crowds and triple-digit temperatures, there are some parks worth visiting since some portions are only accessible or certain natural phenomena are only visible during the summer months. So here are the best national parks to visit in summer. Number 1. Great Sand Dunes National Park in Colorado. The national park is known for its 30-square-mile dune field, but its attractions extend far beyond the sand. There's also water to cool yourself in, alpine routes to hike, and meadows that serve as buffets for graceful species like elk and pronghorn. Consider the sand itself to be both a wonder to behold and the nicest playground you'll ever experience. Number 2. Lake Clark National Park and Preserve in Alaska. It is accessible only by boat and you'll need to fly in by float plane or helicopter to see the 4 million acre park and preserve in southwest Alaska. The huge ancestral home of the Denoina people, located around 120 miles southwest of Anchorage, would take decades to explore. Summer is the best time to visit if you want to see bears. Number 3. Glacier National Park in Montana. The famed 50-mile long going to the Sun Road should be prioritized on any first visit to Glacier National Park. Only once the snow has melted can you drive it from end to end and enjoy Logan Pass, which lies at 6,646 feet. This doesn't always happen until July. The route offers a spectacular combination of mountains, wildlife and history. Number 4. Sequoia National Park in California. Central California's Sequoia National Park, named after the enormous trees that appear as deeply entrenched in history as they do in the soil, will change the way you think about scale. Whether you choose to trek through one of the park's 40 sequoia groves or drive along gorgeous roads, you'll be in for a treat. Winter snowfall frequently blankets huge sections of the park, making summer the best season to visit. You'll never feel crowded here, even on the warmest days when people come to cool down in the towering groves. <laughs> Number 5. Theodore Roosevelt National Park in North Dakota. Summer is Theodore Roosevelt National Park's most popular season, thanks to milder weather and greater access to animal watching. While hunting in the area in 1883, the 26th president fell in love with the badlands, voodoos, and animals. North Unit, South Unit, and the isolated Elkhorn Ranch, where Roosevelt spent time after his wife died, are the three portions of the park. Number 6. Crater Lake National Park in Oregon. Centered on America's deepest lake, it welcomes visitors who want to explore by foot, bicycle, captain boat, or self-driven automobile. When the snow melts, such activities become infinitely more accessible for much of the year, you can't even drive the entire 33-mile scenic rim drive. Number 7. Voyagers National Park in Minnesota. With its 30 lakes and 900 islands, it is a natural aquatic playground for kayakers, paddlers, fishers, and birdwatchers all summer long. The park's interconnecting streams pass across a variety of habitats, from northern hardwood forests to southern boreal forests, birdwatchers will be delighted as well. Over 240 species have been identified, offering a variety of birding opportunities. Please like this video and don't forget to subscribe. See you soon!